Jimmy, it was great to see you at the Academy Award tonight. What were the highlights for you? Uh, just seeing the smiles on people's faces, really. Uh, one summer we had at the old club when I was in the Centre of Excellence growing up, we never had anything like that. So just could see kids smiling, receiving the trophies and happy and the club moving forward, I suppose, progressing in, in the youth department. How important is it to recognise and reward young talent at Scarborough Athletic? Oh, of course it is, yeah. That's that's all you want. I mean, I was a young lad, born and raised in Scarborough, come from ranks, Colo, Blotty. And that's just such a big thing for like homegrown players to play in the first team and progress through the academy and the reserves and into the first team. That's all anyone wants. That's what fans love. Fans love a, an homegrown player so they can sing one of our own. So, yeah, it's a massive thing, yeah. Really good. So you're down here this afternoon, you at the uh, new hit launch, so you've seen it. I have. Um, can you give a hint on your thoughts? I'll give it to you. Well, I'm sure if people know me, they know I'm not exactly notorious for my style or anything like that. Uh, and even it's took me back, to be fair, the kit is unbelievable, home and away. Especially away, I'd say. There's took my breath away, to be fair. Uh, and yeah, it's a mint kit. Hopefully there's a size that fits me and yeah, mint, yeah, mint. Yeah. So, Jimmy, what's going on in the landing room? What's that? Oh. Uh, I generally think this is the worst time of year for management, especially the gaffer. Uh, it's relentless every day. Like, I feel sorry for him, generally feel sorry for him, how busy he is, uh, speaking to agents, players, managers, assistants. Uh, it's just relentless trying to find the right player that's going to fit us uh, for the right price. Um, and like I say, yeah, it, it gets heated in our WhatsApp group. We sometimes have to suspend it, <laughs> opinions. Uh, but just busy non-stop. Like, like I said, the, the gaffer is just relentless. He's speaking to people all the time and then we think we're getting players and then change of mind, get offered more money. Uh, and it's just a really difficult time where the gaffer's working his off all the time. Um, so yeah, it's a uh, yeah, busy time for everyone. Yeah, so Jimmy, we've got some uh, great friendlies lined up. How excited are you to get stuff back in? Yeah, it's, uh, to be fair, we were ready for end of season last year. It, it took its toll with FA Cup and you know the bad run towards the end. It took its toll on everyone, I think, and we were, everyone needed a break. And it's felt like about we've had about three months off now. So. Even though we've got another four weeks before we're back training, yeah, I think we're just all ready and ready to go. And like I say, there's some tasty friendlies there to look forward to. Chef Wednesday, Hartlepool and Hull, I think. Uh, probably take the eye of most people. So, yeah, just looking forward to getting back into it, get training and see all lads again. And, uh, yeah, get it get it back going. Brilliant. Jimmy, thanks for taking time out to speak to us. And, uh, yeah, look forward to the season kicking up. No problem. Of the borough.